Okay, this is part two of the pipe drill, which is just working on how you're pivoting, how your body's gonna work, how it's gonna move, okay? So where we left off was, we got in our setup, let our arms hang, fingertips, and I went through your shoulder rotation, your rib cage, your right hip, and keeping your right knee flex. Now we're going to go at change of direction to finish. A downswing doesn't work like the backswing work. It's got a whole different set of how you move. So we're going to start at the top. Remember, arms are always st straight in this drill. And then what you're going to do first, these are together, but I'm going to do them one at a time. As you're turned and you're going the other way, change of direction, you're going to move over to your left foot, okay? At the same time that you're going over to your left foot, your front foot, your lead foot, the top is going to be coming down. So one's going over and one's coming down because you're on that tilt, okay? Then as you get to your left foot and the top's coming down, you're going to press in the ground with your lead foot. That's what's going to make your hips and your rib cage rotate. So as you do this drill and get to finish, your trail arm, your right arm, will be pointing directly at where you're going. So the keys at the change of direction are moving over to your left foot, which we'll talk about later in more detail. You're going to your left foot, allow the top to come down, and once you're on your lead foot, your front foot, and the top is down in front of you, your hips, your rib cage, that's the big one, your chest, they're all rotating toward down the fairway to the green. Your trail hand will point right at where you're going. Remember, your arms have to just stay straight in this drill. This is a body drill. Okay, get back. Start working on that second part of the change of direction into finish. Take care.